people in the group, like they come through and they, mm -hmm. they encourage each other in such a positive way. I love it when I see that, that oh, you thanks. post. <laughs> I think there's people that play tennis and I think there's people that are tennis players and I consider myself a tennis player. Like that's like part of who I am. Oh, thank Just you. thank you for posting to our group and always bringing that positivity. Well, I try to remember that these are like real people that share a passion hey. for tennis or for anything, you know. A long morning. It's not even five o'clock. It's gonna be so worth it. So worth it. Denver for two reasons. Number one, best friend, Calvin and Andrea, having a baby. Number two, Carrie, super, super dedicated student, always on social media, always posting about her improvement. And last week in our Facebook group, Carrie wrote in and she was like, I just showed up to the court and my partner didn't show up. So she got stood up. It was the coolest thing. A ton of us wrote in and commented back stay out there, like, no, don't leave, stay out there. And everybody encouraged her, help her toward her goals. So I thought it would be cool if I could hit with her in person oh. as an appreciation for how awesome she is. And she lives here? Yeah, she lives here. Perfect. The fire alarm kept going off in the middle of the night. And every time you think it stops, I'm here for your shit, Kirby. It's not even recording. It is recording. No, it wasn't. The red light wasn't on. Nice try, though. This is for all you tennis players out there. Learn how to get hydrated. It's good stuff. You nasty. <laughs> you know, between you and me, just you, me, and the and the car. We got. I got drunk last night. <laughs> oh, we had fun. <laughs> I did. I hope you did too. Oh, I had fun. This is just the entrance. Eight and a half months. Doesn't care. Making me climb up all these stairs. Couple goals. Yeah. It's gonna be you and me here in a couple years. And instead of lifting a weight, you'll be lifting Blake. <laughs> yeah, right. Kirby, tell him, tell the camera who, who beat you up the stairs. I won. Kirby Bridges lost to a soon to be overweight dad. I just straight up lost. She's up. Put on your head. Get some turkey legs. Show him your backpack, Kurt. That little backpack. Yeah, that's pretty neat. I'm ready for the Renaissance Fair. Renaissance. Have you ever been to a Renaissance Fair? I've been, yeah. Yeah, back in uh, Nebraska. What was that like? A lot of turkey legs. I don't really want a turkey leg. You don't? What? I know. You came to the wrong place to not eat a turkey leg. Why'd you even come? Why did you even come? You can go sit in the car. No. That'd probably be for the best. I like to participate. I want to find a boyfriend. <laughs> what kind of uh, social class of husband are you looking for? You know, you've got like the barbarians, you've got like the royalty, well, people I'm... that perform in the arts. You looking for a knight? I'm looking for a knight. Knight. Nice. Oh. You got a long ways to go, Katniss. Yeah. What a fantastic day. Thank, Thank you. you. Angels, assemble. One, two, three. 
Angels, assemble! Searching for turkey legs. Mission completed. Hi, I'm Carrie Stewart and I'm in Denver, Colorado. I'm a 4-0 player. And when I saw that Ian and Kirby were left-handed, I was like, these are my people! <laughs> these are my people! You have helped me understand that practicing is important and warming up is important and having intentions to those, yeah. learning to have more intention to, to practice. So what struck me with Carrie is, is that she's been tweeting us and, and she's in our Facebook group and she's always telling us like how she did in her matches and and people in the group like they come through and they they encourage each other in such a positive way and like so I love it when I see that, that oh, you thanks. post <laughs> something that everybody I know can relate to. Yeah. So everybody jumps in and they're like, you know, I'm here and I know that feeling and, and how do we work through it? Right. Couple of really great three five sixes, mm -hmm. and then um, you know you go from top of the heap to bottom of the heap. Yeah. You lose your confidence. Um, but this season has been a really good season. I've been working on like my mental. Yeah. And I've had some um, epic confidence. It sounds like you're kind of loving that pressure instead of and, like embracing it, instead of running away from it. I do. And the thing that I've really been trying to work on, because I want to learn how to finish a point. So we want to find find the key to that consistency. Yeah. All right. Well, let's. let's yeah. Go. Yeah. but I don't think I do. You have a really good forehand and you can place it so well. We'll drop feet a few. It can change between your shadow swing and between the actual stroke and practice swing. So 25%, okay. 50%. Um, when it comes to your follow through, the very first shadow swing I, or drop feet that I asked you to do, you finish right here. Okay. If the shadow swing, you're here. Drop feed, even better. Beautiful. As soon as I feed it to you, racket stops here. And we're looking for Carrie to take her left hand and it's gonna finish where her palm is facing the opposite direction. She's doing a really good job of that right now. You know it in your head that you need to do this, right, right. but it just needs to become second nature. Yeah. <laughs> slow down our swing is that we start guiding the ball. Your whole body finds the tension. Yeah, and you stop. Instead of going through the laundry list, my feet weren't there, it was too close to my body, I was late, I didn't do the dishes, like whatever's running mm -hmm. through your mind, just take it back to that one the one thought, yeah. okay. where was my racket point? So you make the adjustment and keep it cool. Your forehand is that good. You just have to choose to capitalize on that opportunity. Let's get a drink. there on court as long as you can so that you can find a way and give yourself the amount of time right. to figure something out that works. Right. Yeah. And you already have that ability. Even if you lose O and O, it's your challenge to yourself to make that an hour and a half O and O.
けがいい